Pake Mali to move up. Pake Mali. Ebony Bay. Exceed expectation. 1600 meters in front of this field. They come to attention. Racing from the 1600 meter marker. Miss Lila is towards the back end, second to last. That leaves Ebony Bay as the trailer. Raven Sword in the blue and white silks is moving around them with the cheek pieces in search of the lead into the turn. Blue Eyes not far off the action. Exceed expectation, hard held on the outside. Then comes Pake Mali, racing three lengths off them. Bugsy Malone is a length back. Miss Lila towards the outside. Ebony Bay is the trailer. There's there's only five lengths top to tail. Out in front, Raven Sword laying down the foundation by a length and a quarter. Exceed expectation is hot on the trail in second. Blue Eyes races in third at the halfway stage. 800 to go. Pake Mali. Bugsy Malone swinging along at the rail. Got four lengths to make up. Miss Lila's on the outside and losing touches. Ebony Bay about to come under the drive. Homeward bound, 450 metres in front of them. They see daylight. Raven Sword, yet to see arrival. Exceed expectation. Pake Mali's in the yellow to the grandstand side. Bugsy Malone's trying to work into it towards the inside. Miss Lila the outside. Yes, Pake Mali though. And Pake Mali comes with a big run at the 200 metre marker. Raven Sword tries to fight back. Raven Sword's doing a great job of fighting back at Pake Mali. Raven Sword comes back. Great victory from Pake Mali. Miss Lila and in came Exceed Expectation in this league. It's a big win for Raven Sword, Kelvin Abib, and once again, Wendy Whitehead. Well, you don't want to get too carried away. But number seven, Raven Sword. We give him credit today. He'll get his second victory. It's only a 65 handicap, but in the company, it's a win full of merit. Calvin Abib got him to re-rally. Pake Mali, for all the money in the world, looked like he'd go on by. Yellow Silks of Pake Mali. Raven Sword was already under the drive and asked. Pake Mali probably went about a half a length clear, I'd say. And that's when Raven Sword decided to come right back for more. Gets the battle armor on. Calvin Abib's got the whip in the right hand and then changes it to the left. Gets close to Pake Mali. And as they hit the line, the Wendy Whitehead Calvin Abib Roadshow continues at Hollywood Bets Gravel.